morning, everyone, and welcome to Kane University's first ever virtual open house. My name is Carlos Cesario, and I am the Director of Admissions here at Kane University. We're very excited here to host you today and have an awesome program plan. I will quickly walk you through our agenda for today. So let's start our plan. Under the program overview, on our website or on the lower part of the e-booklet, you have four scheduled blocks. The first is meet the colleges. Then we have two explore on your own sessions. And final, we have the admissions presentation. For your convenience, each block has specific times so you may take advantage of all the events. At 10.50, you'll start your day at Meet the Colleges. Here you will meet the college deans and current students. Click on a Zoom link under the major in which you're most interested in and be transported to that session. If you're undecided, feel free to explore the different sessions to help you decide. But remember, you have 40 minutes, so choose wisely. To optimize your day, check out your electronic booklet that you receive via email or on the website, or you may download it to assist you via the Google app or the App Store, as shown on the screen here. Currently, you're in the President's Welcome part of the agenda, which would begin in a few minutes. I would invite you to scroll down where you will find the program overview. So that's the agenda for today. If you're ready to apply and agree that Kane University is the place for your world-class education, complete your application at kane.edu with the promo code that you see here to waive your $75 application fee. And for all you juniors out there attending today's event, your application will be available in September with your own promo code that we'll provide to you at a future date. At the very bottom of the agenda, our virtual admissions office will be available throughout the entire event where you will find me and my staff ready to answer your questions. Now, at this time, I'm proud to present to you one of our own graduate assistants at the Nathan Weiss Graduate College studying marriage and family therapy, Christian Fiala. Take it away, Christian. Thank you very much. Good morning, everyone, and welcome. I graduated from Keene last year with my bachelor's degree in psychology and sociology. And I, like many of you here this morning, was the first in my family to do so. So it really feels like yesterday where I was in your position of making the decision to further my education and Kane played a huge role in fulfilling that dream of mine. I am very proud to have the opportunity to introduce you all to someone who has dedicated the last 17 years to making this university what it is known as today. The president of Kane University, Dr. Dawood Farahi. <laughs> I hope you join us here at Kane and see for yourself where a world-class education can take you. Welcome to Kane. 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 Welcome to Welcome to Kane. Welcome to Welcome to Kane. Welcome to Kane. Good morning, everyone. I want to welcome every one of you to Kane University, whether you're joining us this year as freshman or sophomore, you will find Kane University to be the best fit for you. We do everything we could possibly do 
to make sure that you get the education that you need and you're prepared not only for today, but also for tomorrow. Our alumni here at Kane succeed beyond their own expectations and beyond the expectations of others. In a few minutes, you'll see how far they have gone and how far they could go. And I also want to make sure that you understand that our world-class education is designed to prepare you for the future. 85% of the jobs that you see today may not be here, and 85% of the jobs that you will see in 2030 haven't yet been invented. So our job is to make sure we prepare you for both, and we do that. And I think you will see that Kane University not only is a good fit for you, and it's a fit for your dreams. It would allow you to succeed as much as you want, as long as you do two things, put in the work and show up for class. And if you do those two, two things, we can do the rest for you. I could tell you a personal story that I think would make a, a case for why you should come to Kane. Uh, when I first came to this country in 1973, my dream was to someday own a Kentucky Fried Chicken or become the manager of a Kentucky Fried Chicken. After two years of working there, I came to the realization that I still had to pay extra money as an employee to get white meat. And I also heard from many of my friends and colleagues that I had to, the potential to do much better. I continued my education and today I have the privilege of speaking to you as the president of King University. We are a mission driven university with quality programs. Some of our health sciences programs are among the best in the country. Our education preparation programs are second to none. Our architecture and design are some of the best in the state and maybe some of the best in the country. We have multiple locations in New Jersey that you can take advantage of it. We have a campus in Tom's River, as you know. We have a campus in Skylands of New Jersey. And we have, of course, our main campus here in Union, New Jersey. In addition to that, we have the largest American public university in China as well. You can succeed in Kane if you wish to do that. And I hope you do. Get yourself a dream, a big one, a majestic one. Set yourself a high goal, again, a big one and a difficult to achieve one. And if you did that and did the work, you will succeed. Now listen to one of our very recent graduates, Asa, and she'll give you some understanding of what happened to her when she finished her studies here at Kane. Asa? Hi everyone, I am Asa Duggar and I am alumna of Kane University class of 2018. I studied media communications and business management at Kane and I'm here to share with you a few highlights of Kane University. Kane invests in world-class faculty who are best in our field, including my favorite professor, Dr. Vicario in the School of Business. Kane invests in new facilities in which you will experience Kane's newest buildings like the Green Lane Building, the North Avenue Academic Building, Heinz Hall, and we're expanding our labs both on campus and at our new Skylands campus in Jefferson, New Jersey. Kane invests in innovation. That's why we've been teaching degree completion programs fully online since 2016. I personally took online classes so that I could balance my internship and my classes to make sure I could graduate on time. Speaking of internships, Kane invests in their students by providing them with opportunities and networks to connect with some of the best companies in different industries. This provides students with the opportunity to land the job of their dreams by graduation. 
I am an intern at Mazars, which is an international accounting firm. I had the opportunity to intern at Premier Stages here at Kane. I'm an intern at Newark Museum. I'm currently in education and exhibition design. I had the opportunity to be an intern at A Squad Rubber Radio, which is internet based, and Magic 98.3. I actually did a whole internship in China through Kane, and I interned with a company called OneHurt as a consultant. And then I did a marketing internship in New York about a year ago. I got my first internship through Kane University's Career Service Center. I interned at the place that I work full time now for the position that I shadowed under. My goal is to become a certified public accountant and Mazars is giving me the experience I need for that. What was really great about my position at Premier was it gave me a very robust understanding of the arts management field and that really helped me steer myself towards the parts of working for a theater company that I really enjoy. Working at Newark Museum and my previous internship experience has allowed me to choose a career path for the future. Being in an internship, I was able to do everything from promotions and events all the way to actually being behind the microphone. Having those two internships help me really gear to what I want to become, which is program director. My internship experience was very helpful for me. The duties that I had to do were really focused on building my skills because some of the skills that I learned at that internship is not necessarily what you learn in the classroom. Internships are inherently based in the education of the participant. Everything that you do is based on your career development and your learning and understanding of your job. I think an internship is a great opportunity for a lot of people to put their knowledge into practice. That's experience on your resume and that's something that all of your employers look at. Through this internship I think I was able to prove myself and show not only my skills but my worth as as a marketing coordinator. After interning for a few months, I was offered a full-time position. As soon as I graduated, I sat down at the desk with the assistant news director. He was so intrigued about all my experience. And he said, I like you. Welcome aboard. For the last couple days of my internship, one of the HR representatives called me into her office and she was like, we would like to bring you on full-time. Here's your offer letter. Think about it. But I knew right then and there, this is where I wanted to be. I interned with CNBC and JTV, and when I graduated, I landed a postgraduate internship with CBS This Morning. World-class academics and internships lead to successful alumni. Kane graduates are succeeding in a big way. Kane graduates are beacons in industry. Like Joe Sheridan, alumni Dennis Letts, a former Secret Service officer who served four U.S. presidents, Alumna Abina Antwi is the lead innovation scientist at Burt Bees. Lillian Agutu earned her bachelor's in architecture last year and was accepted into master programs at Yale, Columbia, and Princeton University. And she's now attending Yale University. That wraps up what I have to share. Back to you in New Jersey, Dr. Farahi. Thank you, Asa. Asa is just one example of the students who succeed here at Kane. We have many more, and if you have an opportunity, you can see and you do your research on Kane, and you will find out that it might be the best fit for you. In addition to that, right now, in the cabinet of Governor Murphy, two of our graduates are working. One is the Brigadier General Jamal Beal, who's in charge of the National Guard, and the other one is Dr. Lamont Rapolet, who's in charge of the entire educational system for the state of New Jersey. By the way, Dr. Rapolette would be my successor and will start her new job as the president of Kane University on July 1st. Let me tell you one thing, which is the most important thing that you might want to remember. Successful alumni start with very successful students. Students who have the desire the commitment and the drive to succeed. So let's start with Daniela, and she has something to tell you. Daniela. Thank you, Dr. Farahi. Good morning, everyone. I am extremely fortunate to have received endless opportunities through Kane University. I have created an abundant amount of experiences to build a strong structure for my career. I express my gratitude to Kane University by helping me grow as a professional and creating my foundation as a future teacher. I hope that you'll join Dean Ridner to learn more experiences and other opportunities within the College of Education. Good morning, everyone. My name is Aralua Wolia, and I'm a senior studying cellular and molecular biology. I'm glad that I chose to attend Kane four years ago, as my love for sciences has grown exponentially here. 
By taking classes that really made me think like neuroscience and organic chemistry, I was provided with the education needed to work in my desired field. I was able to learn a great internship with an OBGYN, obstetrics and gynecology in Harlem, New York, where I started a doctor and got a better understanding of the medical field and the career I wanted to pursue. I hope that you'll join Dean Chang and I for the Dorothy and J George Hennings College of Science, Mathematics and Technology later. See you there. Good morning. My name is Aiden Peralta. I'm a junior studying marketing. My favorite aspect of King University is that everyone is there to help. From tutoring services to professors in each class is taken, everyone is there to help you succeed. One of the very beneficial experiences I've had so far in Kane was being part of research days, where I was able to learn, take the things that I learned from the classroom and use it to research real world business problems. I hope you can join Dean Wang and I at the College of Business and Public Management. Hello, my name is Amanda Victor and I'm a recent graduate of the Michael Graves College, specifically the Graphic Design Interactive mm -hmm. Advertising Program. When I think of Kane, I immediately think of the community. I transferred from another four-year school and I was immediately brought into the Kane family. Once I was here, I was introduced to several career building opportunities that provided the gateway for me to earn three internships during my time at Kane. To me, there's no other school that provides you such incredible opportunities and resources. I hope to see you soon at the Michael Graves College breakout session with D Dean David Money. Hi everyone. My name is Ryan Haig and I am a sophomore in the New Jersey Center for Science, Technology, and Mathematics, also known as the STEM program at Kane. My major is chemistry education and I will be graduating with my master's in 2024. I absolutely love Kane because I've been given an affordable education with so many opportunities to branch out. The STEM program has broadened my knowledge and increased my love for the sciences. So I hope you'll join me and Dean Bostian in the STEM meeting room for our Meet the Colleges session. Good morning. My name is Harold Carius, and I'm a student ambassador and a rising senior studying communications, media, and film. My favorite aspect of Kane University is the in-class experiences and lessons that can be translated into real-world situations. One of the beneficial experiences I have had so far at Kane University is with the state-of-the-art Kane TV studio, where I have been fortunate enough to work the cameras, write scripts, and also be on-air talent. I hope you'll join us with Jonathan Mercantini, Dean of the College of Liberal Arts, and I at the Meet the Colleges session. Thank you, Ambassadors. We're looking forward to meeting you today throughout the different sessions. Be sure to use the website to navigate your day. And now it is my pleasure to reintroduce Dr. Farahi. Thank you, Daniela. And thank you everyone for participating in this virtual open house. I wish I would have been able to see you in person, but that seems to be the best alternative at this point in time. Kane University could be the place that will help you realize your dream. We will do everything we can to help you succeed because your success is our success. So take the virtual tour, take your time, ask questions, learn about Kane, compare us with all of the competition. And if you do that, you will come to Kane and I'll hope to see you soon. Thank you very much. And now take a look at the virtual tour of Kane University. Welcome to Kane University, one of the most diverse college campuses in America. Kane Cougars have been climbing higher since 1855. And we're now the fourth largest public university in New Jersey. There are more than 16,000 of us who learn, live, and grow on our campuses. Here in Union, New Jersey, just minutes from Manhattan. Down the shore, the Kane Ocean, Tom's River. Nestled in the treetops of Northwest New Jersey at Kane Skylands. On your schedule with Kane Online. And halfway around the world at Wenzhou Kane University in China. Our campus is also just a 10 minute shuttle from North Liberty International Airport. Other colleges talk about a global education. We walk the walk literally every day. And we're here to show you around so you can see for yourself what a world-class education looks like. We'll start at Kane Hall, the historic gateway to our main campus. Built in 1915, it used to be a stable and a library, but now it is home to the president's office. Here, you'll also find the Office of Admissions. You can chat with one of our admissions counselors, attend an information session, and take a tour with one of our fabulous student ambassadors. 
it's time to choose from more than 50 undergraduate and 60 graduate programs and start learning in our state-of-the-art classrooms and labs. Here in the Green Lane Academic Building, architecture and design students create and collaborate in an open design suite modeled after Google Studios with inspiring views of campus and New York City. Stop by Barnes & Noble on the first floor to get your books and school spirit gear or grab a coffee before class. Here in our North Avenue Academic Building, you'll find our award-winning computer science, physical therapy, and other health programs. It has state-of-the-art classrooms, breakout spaces, an outdoor terrace, and a high-tech theater, where inspiring speakers like Martin Luther King III have shared their wisdom in Kane's distinguished lecture series. Here you'll also find an obon pan for when you need a snack or a caffeine boost. Across Morris Avenue is the STEM Building, home to the New Jersey Center for Science, Technology, and Mathematics. It has 133,000 square feet of classrooms and research laboratories. And through our Research First initiative, our honor STEM students get to work on cutting edge research early in their freshman year and even earn an internship with ILSA, the Institute for Life Science Entrepreneurship, a nonprofit research incubator right in the building. At the center of campus, you'll find the Nancy Thompson Learning Commons, an inviting place for students from every discipline to work and study, with digital resources and group spaces designed to support new ways of learning. The Learning Commons also offers tutoring and writing support to help ensure your success. The brand new Liberty Hall Academic Center and Museum, New Jersey's only public center for history, recently opened as the new home to the university's history department. The museum was built in 1772 and has many rare artifacts that date all the way back to revolutionary times. It was originally the home of New Jersey's first governor, William Livingston, and is the ancestral home of the Kane family. And by the way, our university is named after the Kane family, and it's pronounced Kane. Not Keen, but Kane. Hines Hall will be our best building yet. Opening in 2020, it'll house all of Kane's undergraduate business programs. It will feature smart classrooms, study lounges, a Bloomberg room with business intelligence software, a virtual library in the sky, and a rooftop deck. Over the bridge on East Campus, students at Nathan Wise Graduate College get hands-on training in psychology, occupational therapy, and speech-language pathology clinics that help them in their career and serve our local community. Your college experience is about more than academics. It's about learning to be confident, independent, and truly yourself. Here you'll join classmates from across the region, country, and world who live and make their home at Kane every year. Our campus has been named one of the safest in America, and the Student Health Services staff work hard to ensure that your physical and mental health is a priority. Our rest halls let you choose what's best for you, with single and double rooms and suites. Cougar Hall is the newest and home to more than 380 first-year students. Hungry? Campus is packed with dining options for whatever you crave. And with not one, but three spots to get Starbucks on campus, you're never more than a moment away from your next coffee break. Stop by our Sino Steakhouse and Tavern, which offers student discounts for those special occasions, like when your family comes to visit. You can always stop by at the Martin Student Center, the heart of campus. Here you can find a game room, computer lab, dining hall, and you can join more than 160 student groups and Greek organizations. It's easy to stay active at Kane, with tons of recreational facilities around campus and in the Angola Gym. Harwood Arena is the place to show off your school spirit and cheer on your classmates. Alumni Stadium has been the centerpiece of outdoor athletics since the 1960s. Pack the stands and cheer on your D3 Kane University Cougars. Kane also has a vital arts and culture scene with art galleries and performing spaces that showcase the work of everyone from internationally acclaimed artists and Broadway legends to student performers and the stars of tomorrow. And with a train station right on campus, you're only 30 minutes away from the culture capital of the world, New York City. Students intern at top companies in New York City, New Jersey, and abroad. In fact, while you're here, we guarantee we'll help you find an internship that fits your career path. And it's where you can learn about our study bar program at our campus in Windsor, China, or 30 other locations around the world. Here's the best part. Studying and living at our China campus costs the same as it does here at Kane USA. So you can climb higher across the world while staying on budget. CAS is also home to the One Stop Service Center to help you with registration and financial aid. 
Kane is the most affordable comprehensive university in New Jersey, which helps our graduates have 32% less debt than the national average. We're dedicated to helping our students graduate on time and on budget. So whether you're studying theater in Union, education at Ocean, bio at Skylands, from home with Kane Online, or business in China, we all have the same goal. Wow, wasn't it awesome? I want to say thank you to Dr. Farahi in his 61st open house that he participated in and send them off, hopefully, with a great open house this time around. We thank you, Dr. Farahi, for everything that you've done, and we hope you all the best in your new step in life. That concludes our president's welcome, and we hope that you enjoyed what we had to show you. And now the next session is Meet the Colleges. Remember, Pick the link of the major that you desire, and if you have multiple majors that you desire, you have 40 minutes to choose. See you then, and remember, the Office of Admissions is open throughout this whole event. Take care, guys. Have fun.